Hey y'all, happy Saturday. Let's see, uh, it's 5.30. I got off work. I drank four beers and took a shower. No, I drank three beers then I took a shower. This is my fourth beer. About gone. I'm going to violate my three knife rule tonight. Three knife rule. Three beer, three beer rule. rule. I think you better cut off right now. I, all I got to do is dice some potatoes. I got three potatoes. I'm gonna, what I'm going to do tonight is uh, up here, up here, up here, camera boy. Uh, Excuse me. <laughs> uh, Moonshine invited me to a uh, showdown, and I'm like, well, hell yeah, I can do that. Uh, it's kind of like a hold down, except uh, we're not dancing. We're going to do a hamburger helper here, homemade. None of that box shit. Uh, I'm going to keep mine as simple as I can. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to try to keep it simple. <laughs> so. What, it's easier for him to explain that way because he can't talk. <laughs> what you need is a skillet, <clears throat> salt, some fresh cracked Jack Black, fresh cracked Black Jack. We're going to need some pepper. A little bit of a, look Rachel, don't she pretty. A little bit of her olive oil. Uh, a little ketchup, we're going to use that for some body. We're going to need some Lee and Perrin's, uh, what's this here sauce? Garlic powder, onion powder, a little bit of flour. Some uh, stock, beef stock. Some hamburger. We got a pound of ground chuck because that's what a box of hamburger helper wants. They want a pound of meat. So that's what we got a pound of ground chuck. I got three potatoes here. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to use all three of them. Uh, I got to dice them up. I forgot one ingredient. Mention that. We're going to need a bag of uh, peas and carrots. Frozen. Right out of the freezer. Frozen. We're going to make a hamburger helper stew. That's what we're going to do. So let me get my potatoes diced up and washed and uh, drink me a beer and uh, find me a knife. You like my bozo hairdo? <laughs> if it was a different color, I'd be like, bozo, wouldn't I? So that's what happens when you get out of the shower. You are a bozo. Yeah, we'll be back. <laughs> okay, uh, potatoes are diced. That's what size they are. Look in there. I don't want to put my hand in the water. So, got them sitting in the water so they don't turn brown on me. Got the cast iron heating up. Pour the little the young lovely's oil in there. You don't need a lot, but put some in there. Uh, dump some ground chuck in there. Little sizzle. A little fresh cracked jack. We're gonna put more later, don't worry. Of course, sea salt. Onion powder going in. All of this we're gonna add later too. So, if you want to know measurements, talk to Betty Crocker. Garlic powder going in. I need a thingy. This will work. All right, we got to brown this hamburger up. We we'll get it browned up, and then we'll come back and show the next step. Huh? Yeah. Okay. Uh, we got my hamburger brown chuck browned up. That's what it's looking like. I think I'm going to need a little butter though. Butter will give a little richness. So we'll just chuck a tablespoon of butter in there. Get that melted down. It won't take long. I can stir and stir. Uh, you're off the burner. That's where you had it. Well, that's where it was supposed to be. Well, don't yell at me then. I didn't. So we're going to get this uh, butter melted down. And then we're going to put some flour in there. Come on, butter. No. Yeah. I'll add a little richness to it. 
and flour and how much I don't know I'm doing this all completely by the ear uh, on the ear uh, off the cuff off, yeah that too <laughs> I've never done this before I'm just uh, fucking around guys just fucking around Moonshot invited me on this and I was like hell yeah I can do this so we're gonna go um, just shy of a tablespoon and a half of flour No, I'm not making milk gravy, but it's close. Y'all been watching my vid, you know, that's what it looks like. So now what we're going to do... Beef broth. Huh? Beef broth. What? Beef broth. No, we ain't going to put no beef broth in there yet. Oh. You film. Make sure people can see what they're looking at. I'm showing them a skillet of meat. That's what you need. <laughs> now... We're going to take these potatoes out of here. Drain all that water out of the can. I got to look at the potatoes to know how much seasoning I got to put in here. About that much? Well, we're going to need a little bit more than that. <laughs> you just uh, concentrate on your filming, girl. <laughs> We're getting all carried away here. Spread these potatoes out. And then the fresh cracked jack goes on first. And I'm using reduced sodium uh, beef stock. And that ain't going to work with potatoes, is it, Terry? No, because potatoes love salt. Potatoes love salt. <laughs> it took me 35 years by God, but I learned her one thing. Potatoes love salt. Yeah, but who had to teach who how to fry chicken? Yeah, well, I still can't do it right. I know you can't. So now, I'm going to stir this up a bit. Notice it's all sticking to the bottom. That's what we want. Okay, go back with a little garlic powder. Put that oil in there and my bed in there. Little onion powder. I didn't feel like cutting an onion up. Besides, some people don't like onions, like my sister. She ain't eating it. Okay, yeah, this is true. Ah, right, we're gonna put a little ketchup in here. And I like the onion. I always use Brooks. Brooks ketchup. I always use Brooks. Well, if they can't get Brooks. Uh, call the company or send me in a letter. <laughs> uh, what's this here? Lee and Perrins or Heinz or whatever kind you got? Lee and Perrins going in. Give us a quick mix. Get on there. <laughs> Damn. Find the fucking skillet. Okay. <laughs> you can't film and laugh too. Uh oh. No, you lost We're, the potato. Lost the potato. Now, you notice all this stuff stuck to the bottom of the skillet? I'm wanting that. That's what I'm wanting. Beef broth going in. Or this is the stock. What's the difference? Uh, yeah, Google it. Now we can scrape all this goodness up off of the bottom there. I'll get me a better scraper. Hold that. I can't film and hold with this spoon. A little bit more broth, stock, liquid, something. Here. Make a mess, Keith. Yeah. Well, of course. I just cleaned the stove this morning. Yeah, I'm going to clean it tomorrow, too. Uh, you can. I will. It'll be tomorrow, though. Why? I'll be too drunk later to clean this thing. What? When you get done stirring and this, you can take a rag and wipe it up. Are you on drugs? No. I don't work all damn six days in a row now. But living with you, I ought to be. Yeah, well. Something. I used to be. Okay. We're going to have to let this cook 
for about 20 minutes. Uh, I want to make sure I got enough stock in there. Sorry, do it. I just keep making bigger mess. Oh, sorry. Okay, so that looks pretty good. I gotta leave room for my veggie tables. Uh, I know I need more fresh crack jack, just because I, I know. You gonna make some rice too? No, I ain't making no rice too. How much rice? Too bad. Go to Cajun Land. Visit one of them coon asses. Fine. Okay, see. You. Out the door you go. Okay, we're gonna let this simmer. Cook these potatoes. Uh, I gotta get them up. I gotta get it up to temperature here. It's almost bubbling. I used about almost two thirds of this. So 32 ounces. You do the math. I used almost two thirds. This is aggravating the piss out of me. What? My potato. Well, why'd you throw it there? I threw it in the sink and get rid of it. Uh, yeah, now you did. You don't forget it, hey. Olive oil. What's this here sauce? Spices, ketchup, broth, stock, flour, meat, potatoes. We're bubbling. We can turn this down now. Simmer. Uh, two potatoes get about tender. You don't want to cook them all the way because we still got to put our veggie tables in there. The vegetables? We're going to go, uh, it's 5.55 now. Damn, I wish it was 4.20. Uh, you missed that. Okay, so, yeah, I missed the 5 o'clock somewhere, too. Fuck it. Uh, uh, we're going to go, uh, I'm going to say 12 after. How's that? 12 after, yeah, yeah. 12 after 6. We'll come back and check on this. And we'll be back. That's like three beers from now. Okay. It's 6.12. Notice how this has gotten thickened. Thickened. It, it thickened up on me. Thicker. Yeah, I got thicker. Potatoes are still not quite done. But I gotta cook, put my veggie tables in there, and they're gonna have to cook some more. Do you have an issue with saying vegetables? That's non-union, man. And uh, as these uh, cook down, they're gonna release a little liquid, so that's gonna thin it out a little bit more. But uh, I think in the end, we're gonna be good. I'm gonna put about a half a bag of these in here. Mm, lots of carrots. That sucks. Now, that cooled it down a little bit, so it might take a few more minutes to heat up and uh, cook away. But it smells good in here right now. It really does. Yeah, it does. But we're, I'm going to be honest with you on this. Uh, I'm going to let Terry try this shit because... Uh, He's chicken. No, I'm, I'm prejudiced. I know my shit's good. So I'll let her try it. And then she can tell you what she thinks. And then uh, I can taste it and give you a real opinion. Uh, so, what I, an ass. I may need to add a little bit more liquid to this. Uh, we'll see. We'll let them vegetables cook down, and uh, really, I think I want some more of them in there. I'll put them all in. You ain't got that many okay. in that bag anymore. Okay, put them anymore. all in there. There, there. It's a whole bag. That's a, like a sixteen or fourteen point four ounces. Get a bag like that. Fourteen point four ounces. That's what you need. So we'll do that, and uh, now you see, I got a real thick pot of stuff here. Good. That's the way I want it. And uh, may need to add more liquid. We'll see. We'll just uh, put a lid back on here. No, I can't do that. I got to add more liquid. Oh, what a weenie. No, it ain't. That's it's, uh, it's too damn thick. It's, uh, it's going to be too thick. We'll add just about that much. 
fourth of a cup, half a cup? What? Oh, hell no, that was like a... Uh, Third of a cup? No, that was like uh, two tablespoons. I couldn't see. Your hand was in the way. Yeah, well... It was like two tablespoons more. So we're going to put it in down the... <clears throat> God damn, I wish I could talk tonight. I worked six friggin' days in a row, man. I wore out. They're killing me at work. They're just fucking killing me. That's all there is to oh, it. Oh, quit whining and crying. Let's put a lid on here. I wiped up the stove and part of it. Now I made another mess. And, uh... Moonshine! Space Cowboy! Bubba, get your drunk ass in here. Russ? Uh, y'all do what you want to do. This is what I'm doing. This is me. Uh, when M Moonshine invited me to this the other night, and I'm like, dude, uh, I knew instantly what I was going to do. I, I knew I was going to do this dish. Uh, it's something I liked. Um, I, I, I don't I do not do hamburger helper anymore. I don't buy that shit anymore. I had to give it up years ago. But something that I remember as a kid, I, I like their hamburgers too. I like the potato stroganoff, but I ain't cooking with no sour cream. So, uh, I did that. And uh, this is what we're going to do. And I'm going to drink pops. Right, JB? And uh, I think I need another one. We'll be back. You ready? All right. Okay. I didn't hear you again. Open them ears up. That's what we're looking at, y'all. Don't they look good? I don't need no freaking chemicals to cook a meal. I bet the carker ain't got shit on me. So, these potatoes are still just a little bit crunchy. But we're going to let this sit. Uh, I'll turn it off and I'll let it sit here. I may go ahead and cook this uncovered for another two minutes, then turn it off and just let it sit and cool. Let the potatoes finish cooking. So it's 6.30 now. I'll let that go two more minutes, and then I'll turn it off. And uh, we'll be back when we build a plate. I need a beer. So we'll be back. Okay, so that's what we ended up with. Hamburger helper stew. Hey, don't that look pretty? Smells good in the kitchen. Nothing stuck to the bottom. Looks good. See the skillet? See? Ain't nothing on the bottom down there. Nothing to stuck. So, I'm going to make Terry a uh, bowl here. And, uh... See what she thinks. I'll try this a different way. So I want to get a spoon that works. I got a spoon that works. I got this too. So let that cool off a little bit and she'll taste it in a minute and uh, she'll give you an honest opinion. Because if I tell you what I think, you know what I'm gonna say. It's friggin' awesome. Because I make friggin' awesome food. You are so full of yourself. Uh, no, I ain't. I'm honest. Truthful. Conceited. Yeah. I'm a veteran. I'm a veteran. Yeah. So. So, there we go. So. Yeah. Uh. Give it a taste, man. Tell them what you think. It's hot. I ain't. Oh, oh, blow on it, damn it. I can do it like you, oh, as I could film yeah. you instead of the cabinet. Yeah. I'll eat, you You talk. How's that? No. Potatoes probably could cook a little longer, but I don't care. I'm hungry. She's hot. It's hard to quit. It needs something. It needs something. Mm -hmm. Don't ask me what, but it needs something. 
<laughs> She's hot, man. Yeah, eat something. You know what it needs? Paprika. Not a damn thing. You found quick critique of my food. This shit's friggin' awesome, man. This is good. <laughs> you told me to give me you my opinion. Well, your opinion sucks. This is good. Well, kiss off. Now don't ask me anymore. There are plenty of pepper in there, plenty of salt. No, and if you can't tell me what it needs, then you don't know what the fuck you're talking about. It's hard to buy him. This is good, y'all. Yeah, this is good. Okay. Can I go eat now? Hell no, you done pissed me off. It needs something, but I don't know what the fuck it needs. What kind of answer is that? It needs onion. No. Hamburger Helper, do you know not add onion to Hamburger Helper? That's why I use the onion powder. I don't want onion powder. I try to keep this traditional. I, I, re, I, I purposely I left the onion it. out. I purposely left the onion out. All right. Yeah, I would like to have some onion too, but um, when you buy Hamburger Helper, you don't get onion. You get onion powder. This really is good, man. It really is. I don't care what she says. Need the biscuit to go with it. Any fucking thing else? How about some Jack and Coke? No. There you go, Bubba. I don't drink that. I don't either, but uh, this is good, y'all. Okay, can we go eat now? And if I heard no mine. I'm going to go upload this. Alright, you guys, you know what you're shooting against? Uh, shooting against, uh, <clears throat> this is good. It really is good. No, there ain't no damn onions in here. I, I purposely left the onions out for a reason. Whatever. So, I, I'll try to keep it traditional. Uh... I tried to keep it simple. Lord, I'm fucking simple. Yeah, well, tell him bye. Y'all have a good one. Troy, Sunshine, Moondog, whoever the fuck you are. Who is he this week? Moonshine. Moonshine, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Russ, Bubba, show me what you got, dude. We'll be back next time. Maybe tomorrow. Who knows? See ya. Okay. Hey, y'all. That's what we ended up with. This shit rocks, man. It really does. Uh, I think the reason Terry thinks it needs onions is because I really do have too much pepper in here. Too much fresh crack jack. Uh, cut out one of the stages towards the end of the pepper that I added and I think y'all will be happy with this. This really was a good dish. It turned out a, a lot better than I thought it would. Uh, I'm the cook here so I know. Terry's just a camera person and the wife so she don't know shit. Uh, I know more than you do. Uh, you can never build nothing like this. Maybe not about cooking but I know more about other things than you do. We're talking about cooking. This is a cooking care. channel. This is a cooking channel. I don't care. Yeah, yeah. It's not a religious channel. It's not a sex channel. I don't care. It's not a political channel. I don't care. It's a cooking channel. Oh, shut up. This stuff rocks, y'all. Get, get a shot of this, Terry. Uh, let everybody know. Um. Cut out the last shot of pepper that I put in there and do everything else the way I did it. Uh, uh, one other thing. You could slice the potatoes thin and it would reduce the cooking time. 
But other than that, no, this, this stuff was really good. I, I really liked this. It was good, but it just needed something. It, it needed the... It needed a lot less pepper. That's all it well, needed. Well, yeah, and that, but... Yeah, that's all it needed. That's, that's all it needed. Or a biscuit to go with it or something. <sighs> See, that ain't got nothing to do with the dish, though. You wanted a side item like some hunk of bread, hell, you could have uh, heated you up some garlic bread. It needed something to go with it. Okay, so you could have uh, could have made you some garlic bread, but the dish itself was right on. Whatever. Trust you me. You asked my opinion, now you want to get defensive about it. No, no, no. Now, I'm not asking your opinion now. I'm just telling you to shut up and film because you're a camera person now. You're not a food critic. All right, don't, don't ask me about what, what how, why? She okay. needed a piece of fucking garlic bread to go with her dish, man. All right? You that, didn't give me no sliced onions. It doesn't need any onions. I didn't say in the dish. I said sliced onions. I'll give you a whole one over there. I got a, I got a big old Vidalia over there I'll give you. No, but, save uh, that for some other time. All right, screw that. We'll save that for tomorrow. I'm mad so, now. She's mad and I'm glad. Ball of ink to make her stink. Something like that. We used to say when we was kids. But anyways, uh, no. Now seriously, this Pissed stuff. Pissed me off. You <laughs> fucking jerk. <laughs> Pissed me off, you fucking jerk. <laughs> <laughs> this really was good, y'all. It really was. And uh, just cut out a little bit of a fresh crack jack there. That, that, that's all you got to do. Uh, but other than that, man, this this, this uh Sorry, played it. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I am more than satisfied with this. Yeah, it's the first time doing this, and I'm happy, and, uh, yeah, I'll do this again. Yeah, this is cool. So, uh, Moonshine, Troy, there you go, guys. Bubba, I ain't got no crystal light tea with no friggin' whiskey, so I'm drinking my beer, dude. Let's see what we got. So, and, uh, we'll be back next time. Y'all have a good one.